Do you like making money fast? The faster the better, right? Well, I got an idea for you today. But for sure, if you want to make money fast, you better subscribe to this YouTube channel and click on the notification button. That's how you make money, right? Okay, so I want to bring you an idea. And then at the end of this, you tell me if it makes sense or not. Or if I am, you know, being delusional here. So what you have in front of you is a chart for Aduro. As you can see, Aduro recently reached on February 16, the stock price, this is in Canadian dollars, by the way, 114, right? And since then, Aduro is down like 25%. So it's at 87 right now. Again, this is Canadian. Now, why did the stock price go down here? Well, if you look at the press releases on on uh, March 8th, 2023, Aduro announces private placement of up to $2.5 million, right? So March 8th, so somewhere here, March 8th, right? The stock was over a dollar and then it went below that because that private placement was at... 93 cents right so what happens a lot is that when the stock is at a dollar some people that own the stock and want to participate in their private place on what they do they shouldn't do this but that's what they do they sell it at a dollar and then they rebuy it uh at 0.93 uh, in a private placement, right? And then enough people do it. Some people do it fast. They do it at a dollar and then it starts going down more and more. And eventually, uh, it doesn't make sense to sell it anymore, but, you know, usually sells down to the price of the private placement. And even at like 92 cents right now, they might still sell it at 92 cents and buy it back at 93 because usually those things have... A warrant attached to them right and in this case there was half a warrant at uh, 130 Canadian right but now now as I am making this video the price is at 87 and it is below 93 which was the private placement that this was on March 8th it was announced and then it closed it closed on April 4th, right? So usually take that much time for people to wire the money and close. So why, why is it now below 93 cents? And is this an opportunity uh, to make money possible? If you look at this press release from May 18, 2021, right? So two years ago, Almost two years ago, Aduro Clean Technology announces closing of oversubscribed strategic private placement of units. So on May 18, 2021, the company did a private placement where it issued uh, 3.8 million units at a price of 55. Again, this is all Canadian. With each unit consisting of one common share of the, of the company, and then one half, one half of one common share warrant. So half a warrant with each warrant being exercisable to acquire one share at an exercise price of 0.8 per, uh, per share. And then, so those people that got half a warrant they have to exercise the warrant and they have to exercise it at 0.8, right? And they have 24 months to exercise it. So 24 months, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to use this date, May 18. What's 24 months from that? Well, May 18, 2023, right? So the, those warrants expire what, in about two to three weeks, right? And now the stock is at 87. So what I think is happening is that 
there's some people who have those warrants and they have to send the company money, right? Because they have to send 80 cents to the company and then the company issues them one share of common stock, right? But many people don't have the money. Many people don't have the liquidity today to, to come up with the money. So what I think is happening right now is that some people are selling the stock at 87, anything above 80, right? So let's say if they're selling it today at 87, then they're going to buy it back at 80 cents and pocket the difference and then still have the same number of shares. So for example, let's say if you had, if you, if, if you had, those warrants, and you had 10,000 shares in your account, right? And you sold those shares for 87 cents, you would get 8,700. But now, to exercise and to buy back those 10,000 shares, you only need to send the company $8,000. So you pocket the $700 difference. And if you have 100,000 shares, you pocket $7,000 difference, right? So this is what might be putting pressure on Adura's stock today. And I think that there is a possibility that after this May 18 date, when those warrants expire, they have to be either exercised or expire, there will be no more pressure on Adura's stock from, th from this particular exercise. So we might see an opportunity to, you know, buy Adura stock at 87, maybe 86. Who knows how long they're gonna, how low they're gonna go, and then after May 18, the stock might rebound because of that. Now, of course, there's no guarantees because, you know, who knows what the Fed is gonna do tomorrow? Who knows what the economy is gonna do within the next three weeks? But uh, you know, it might make sense. So you tell me now, does, does a short-term trade like this make sense for you? Is this something that, you know, is, is this an opportunity to make some quick buck uh, in, a, in a period of three weeks? Or is this something that you would rather not get involved in? Um, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And if I missed anything, you know, let me know.